Hey guys, Wayne here from HG Tech Videos. Today I want to show you how to reset your Samsung Galaxy S9 or S9 Plus back to factory settings. To do this, first we're going to swipe down from the top, upper right corner, click on the settings wheel up here. And then we're going to go down to accounts. Let's see, cloud and accounts. Okay. Go to accounts. Tap on your Gmail. You may have a bunch of accounts here, but just click on um, your Gmail. We're gonna need to remove the Gmail account, okay? If you have multiple Gmail accounts signed in, remove them all. That's the main one you need to remove. If not, it will lock your phone and make it difficult for you to reset the phone and then give it to someone else and for them to use it. So that's why you always wanna take your Google account off before you do anything else, okay? Next, I would recommend you do uh, a backup so you can back up your information. Um, you can also use a smart switch to back up your information to a micro SD card, or you can back it up to the Samsung Cloud as well. So if you do sign into a new device, maybe you, you're upgrading to another Samsung device or you're switching phones, your information will be backed up in the cloud. So I do recommend you do that first. Now, we're gonna go back and we are going to, let's see. Basically at the top here, we're gonna type in um, reset. And then you will see factory data reset. Go ahead and tap on that option. Swipe all the way down, hit reset, and then hit delete all. And that's it guys. Now you're gonna let your phone um, reset. So it's gonna totally erase all your information off of the phone. And then it's gonna set it up like brand new. All right. If you run into this specific issue, uh, there's an issue I've been seeing on a couple of Android phones. So I just wanna go over it just in case you may have seen this. If you try to remove your Google account and it did not let you, if it said, oh, this account cannot be removed, something administrator, what you're gonna wanna do is um, take all your other Google accounts off the phone, factory reset the phone, then you're going to set up the phone as if you were going to set it up for yourself. So you're gonna, it's going to ask you to choose a language, then it's going to ask you to connect to Wi-Fi, and then after that it's going to ask you to sign into the last Google account you had on the phone. That specific account that you were unable to remove, you're going to sign into that account again and then skip all the other prompts. And once the phone takes you to the home screen, you're gonna go to settings, go back to cloud and accounts, and then it will let you remove that Google account so you can completely wipe the phone. After it allows you to remove the Google account, you're gonna factory reset the phone again, and then the phone will be fully cleared of your Gmail account. Okay, again, if you're not able to take off your Gmail account, you don't wanna just factory reset the phone and give it back or turn it in because it will brick the phone and the, the let's say you return it to the store or you sell it to someone. Unless they have your Gmail information, they're not gonna be able to get past that to set the phone up. So just wanted to give an FYI for anyone that may run into that issue in trying to factory reset your phone. Hope you guys did find this helpful. Make sure you like, favorite, and share if it was helpful. Hit that subscribe button as well. And make sure you also follow us on Instagram at HTech Videos for monthly giveaways and a bunch of other really cool stuff. Thanks again for watching, guys. Take care and have a good one.